So, um, as Tom was mentioning earlier, this is Tom's last SIGGRAPH. So we couldn't let that go. This is the same picture that Tom had um, before. If you didn't spot where Tom was, that's Tom. Front and center of the Vulcan Working Group, as, as always. So um, not only has um, Tom been um, here at SIGGRAPH for many, many years, you know, Tom has been chairing the OpenGL ES Working Group before the Vulcan Working Group since 2006. So there's, there's a history here. This is the earliest known picture of Tom in the Kronos habitat. And if you don't recognize it, there. <laughs> so I was looking back through the OpenGLES attendance records. And the first meeting that Tom attended for OpenGLES was 2002. So it's over 20 years. And uh, Tom, this was, in, this was the OpenGLES working group in 2005. And then the year after, Tom became chair. And under Tom's guidance, you know, let's recognize us for a moment, OpenGLES um, is, is probably still today the world's, the universe's most widely adopted 3D API. For one brief shining moment, every single platform in the known universe supported a single API. Alas, not to last, but it was quite an achievement. This is Tom earliest picture at SIGGRAPH that I was able to find in 2006. I think that was just around the time Tom became the um, OpenGL ES chair with a motley assortment of fins, <laughs> if you recognize them. And I'm sure many of you have wondered, who are not in, in a working group, what is it actually like being at a Vulcan working group meeting? Well, this, this is the sausage being made. And as far as I can work out, this is Tom. <laughs> up there at, at, at the front. So, but that, the Vulcan working group meetings nowadays, it's three to four days of intense uh, discussions. It's a lot of work, Tom. So we absolutely appreciate everything that you've done. The, the impact that you've had through your leadership and your contributions have been significant. And from a personal point of view, having you around for over 20 years, it's like having um, a graphics expert, um, my favorite professor, and, and a good friend, all wrapped up into one. So thank you. <laughs> and, and we have this for you now. But full disclosure, yeah, pizza, full disclosure, we're going to grab this back straight from you because we're going to get everyone to sign it at the face-to-face. -face. It's the working group picture from Chicago. So, speech. Well, <laughs> well, I already made my speech. You heard it earlier. I, I will say working in this group and with these people uh, has been an incredible experience, one I never anticipated back when I was a young engineer swearing to my manager that I would never want to be involved with management or any kind of committee work. And in fact, a very wise mentor of mine back, back then said, I told him this, and he said, yeah. He said, someday you will want to do something that is bigger than you can possibly hope to do by yourself, and that day you'll change. And that day did come for me back in 2006. It's been, you know, repeating myself, unbelievably rewarding, unbelievably fun, and I uh, wish I could say I will miss it. <laughs> <laughs> I, will miss, I will miss many things about it, of course, most of all the people. Um, and again, thanks. Everyone in Kronos, thank you, Neil. The impact you've had on my career is unspeakable. I never dreamed when I staggered into SIGGRAPH 2002, where Neil was presenting to an audience of three about his plan for OpenGLES, that we would end up here. So thank you. 
and thank you all.